What's up everybody, Judd Johnson here from DieselCrew.com, of course you know the Remy wants to know today, what do I think about someone training for grip sport after they've had a successful recovery from a severe thumb injury? And I think it's a great idea to train for grip sport after you've fully recovered from a thumb injury. However, there are some things I would specifically avoid at all cost, and that number one would be anything where you have to open your thumb up really wide. You really got to be careful. Anything where you're going to have to do this with your thumb or open up really wide away from your finger, those two movements those are going to be high risk movements. If you keep your thumb close to the fingers and not vary from from that angle, then you should be good. I would think thick bar would also be good as well. My buddy Luke has dislocated his thumbs before and he's been lucky enough to do some pretty wide grip training, but he has run into a few problems here and there. So you're never 100% back into the norm with your thumb once you've had some serious trauma to it. So you've got to be extremely careful. Some other things that I wouldn't, that I, that I would wonder about, okay, is if you did any monkey grip training, would this stress it out too? Because you end up getting pressure on the thumb this way, okay? But other than that, I, I wouldn't be too concerned about like a normal bar grip wouldn't be too concerned about grippers, wouldn't be concerned about moderate thick bars, so something in like a two inch range probably wouldn't be too bad. Remember, the wider you go, the more it turns into pinch and more it stresses the thumb. So I would I would try to stay away from those things. But other than that, eventually you gotta strengthen that hand back up. So uh, grip sport and grip specific training is, is definitely the way to go. Um, hopefully I've hit that question properly. Remember, I'm not a, a physical therapist or anything. Um, I have had plenty of injuries and I've recovered from them and some of them have gone really quickly and I hit the nail on the head with what I selected for my recovery drills, my rehab drills. Uh, but there's been other times where it's been months and months and months. In fact, I still have an issue going on right here in my finger. And that has been going on, it'll be two years in January coming up. So nothing I've tried has really completely healed that. It's probably gonna need some serious time off and I'm just not willing to do it. Real smart, Napalm. So anyway, that's, uh, that's it for today. Give it one of these, be sure to subscribe. If you have a question that you want me to answer, you need to be on my email newsletter. Easiest way to do it is just email me, jed.diesel at gmail.com. That's two D's in Jed, dot diesel, D-I-E-S-E-L, at gmail.com. Email me. I'll get you on the list, and I'll take your question. All the best in your training, everybody. Take care.